Hey, what's up, friends? You're stuck here, too? You know what? It's way too nice to be cooped up in this building today. Let's go wander around by the door and see what we can do about that. Hopefully no one's looking. I think we made it. Is it cool? Oh, we found some kind of random roadside plaque, something about a garden or something. Oh, let's go check it out. Well, this doesn't look anything like a community garden. <laughs> it's obviously long gone. Huh, I found a little plaque up there and it says this was a 1960s garden. Kind of cool, let's go take a look at it. Yeah, there we go, huh? It's a planting. I don't know if it was a garden or if there was just something here, a tree. Well, it's just a rock. And nothing there. That was interesting. It's kind of, this thing's been here forever. And I never noticed it. <laughs> Driving by it every day. Let's see what else is around here. Let's see if we can find any remnants of anything. What do we got here? Wow, look at that, huh? Hosties? Hostess beverages? I have one of these bottles. Wow, I wonder if somebody threw this out the window like in the 60s or 70s or something. On the way by. As they were getting off the highway years ago. I'm just sitting here by this tree. That's kind of cool. Let's see what it, it looks like it was dug out and like leveled down there for something though. So maybe that's what it was at one time. Some type of little community garden. Amongst all the trash, there is a stone wall, like, uh, not stone wall, but a, an older drain there. Nice style drain. Huh. I wonder what this area was, just sitting here alongside the highway. Yeah, nothing else in here, just more of these old drains. They probably built these when they built the highway. Old tree. But yeah, I mean, it looks, looks like it was leveled out, but... Nothing back here. A bunch of trash, car parts, dead trees. Oh, speaking of dead trees. Look at this thing. Let's get a little closer. This thing probably came down in the tornado two years ago or so. I think it's a monster. Wow. Huh. That was a random find. Beautiful morning, though. But I got to get to work. What's going on, friends? Rich Discovery's coming at you from back at the house. I wanted to show you this bottle that, I had, uh, that we found today. It came out really nice. Cleaned up really well. Hostess. That was a surprise find. I didn't expect to see that. Uh, oh, and like I said, told you in a video I had another one just like it, so now I've got two of them. Maybe if I put them together, they will, uh, maybe I'll have three. <laughs> Anyways, I, I've been getting off that exit for over 20 years, every day, and I've never noticed that rock with the plaque on it. I just happened to notice it, uh, yesterday and I was a little late to work already today so I said what's an extra 10 minutes so I parked my car I looked at it the reason I said 1964 in the video is because when I had originally parked and ran up to it before I filmed I thought I said 1964 on it I don't know why but that's just what I thought I saw it clearly doesn't say that so I don't know when it's from I do know there's a lot of WPA era stuff around here around New Haven County uh, and they put plaques like that brass I guess brass plaques like that um I don't think that is from them because usually it says right on it, you know, Works Progress Administration. So I don't, I don't think it's from then. It might be from like the 60s, 70s. I know they were doing a lot of beautification, stuff like that, projects like that around that, that era. Uh, maybe even the 80s. I, I really don't know. I might even pop this in a local group because there's a lot of great historians on the area that may actually know what that is and when it's from. But I don't know. It was a garden. It was a tree they planted. Like I said, originally I had no idea what it was. I thought it might have been a memorial for somebody. I had no idea. So... Glad I stopped anyways because this bottle was a spectacular find. And we're just going to keep rolling with all the noise. This is I can't tell you how many times I've done this. But hopefully you enjoyed it. Just a little something. A little something to put out there and share with you all. And hopefully you enjoyed the, uh, you know, the beginning and the little, not the skits I've been doing lately, but the little pieces I've been throwing in the videos or different intros or stuff in the middle just to kind of spice it up a little bit. You know, make it, make it a little different than just uh, the everyday average channel that's out there. So... Just trying to have a little fun, but hopefully you guys enjoy that stuff. And hopefully all the clips I made 
that I'm about to try to edit together now will come out exactly the way I envisioned it. I filmed it over a few different days, put a few things together, and then uh, had that intro and said, why don't I use it on this fine from today? So thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. Um, like I always say, get out there and discover your world, even in places that you drive every single day, because you'll never know what you'll find right around your, your daily drive that you've hit for 20 years and never noticed. And maybe even find a cool little bottle. Make a friend for this one. So <laughs> I don't know about the Hostess Beverage Company. I, I, I can't find much online about it, so I don't know the era of it, but it is quite heavy. It's got some weight to it, so it, it's an older glass, but... Really glad I found that just sitting there. That was that was the icing on the cake for that stop. So thanks for watching. I already said everything else, so uh, have a great day.